Good morning. It's Thursday, July 23rd. It's uh, 7 o'clock, a little after, and we are trying to make about 15 miles today. It is supposed to rain, and we did pack up our tents wet. So hopefully over the next couple days they'll get dried out. So I'm not exactly sure what's in store for us. I don't think the terrain's too exceptionally bad. The mosquitoes are bad. It's the first time the mosquitoes have been really aggressive wherever we've been. So I killed quite a few. Don't mess with me. <laughs> a little foggy this morning. Oh, that trail's good so far. I'd love it if it was like this the rest of the day. So I ran into Wild on the trail. He was nice enough to take a picture with me. Uh, it was pretty funny. We were going down to get some water from a spring. They had camped just a quarter mile up from that. And they did pass our camp last night, but they were in a hurry because the storm was coming. And uh, Blue Jay says, I think that's Wild. And then when we went past their camp this morning, uh, it was, <laughs> but, uh, he had just gone down to the stream. I guess he was in his skivvies. He said, no, how about you take your picture when you come back up by my camp? That was kind of funny. Well, I can hand you poles up to her for this one. This one doesn't look bad. It's kind of like long step. It's <laughs> kind of crazy. I always like watching someone else go up. Yeah, it's not that bad. Good job, Pollyanna. <laughs> Looks like there was a blue trail. Yeah. <laughs> off, off to the left that they don't tell you about. <laughs> and you know, there was a red blaze trail. That was, I think, the rattlesnake trail or something. So Blue Jay's been waiting for us for a little while. You can see it's overcast today. It's been drizzling off and on. The clouds are heavy. Um, Blue Jay went on ahead. Whoa. He's uh, gonna try to get to a deli I don't know that we're going to make it before it closes. It closes at 2. And it's a ways. <laughs> Five something. We'll see. We got 8.9 more miles because we're going to go to that second shelter. So we don't have to do an 18 mile tomorrow. We're going to try for 13 to mile. Yeah. 13 miles tomorrow. And what will today's be? About six. Today's would be 14, 9, something. Almost 15. Almost 15 today. So it's going to take us all day. We'll probably get into tank camp between five and six we'll see depends on the terrain depends on the terrain what kind of bird is that i don't know do, do, do. And about seven and a half. It's a little after 11. And uh, sun's trying to come out to make it warmer. <laughs> so we're up on the ridge top. You can see behind me. It's a little fogged in, but not bad. I like this kind of path in the pine trees. Not a lot of rocks. <laughs> it doesn't happen very often. We're getting ready to climb again. So Pollyanna, how's your day going? Well, I was really ready for this lunch. Yeah. I wish it was like twice as much. <laughs> and um it's been okay. You know, the rocks are wet. I've slept a couple of times. 
that never makes me happy. I have a little blood blister on my thumb. Yeah. But I'm good. Yeah, so we've gone past the first shelter and we're committed now to the second. So yes, we are. One way or another, we'll get to the second shelter. All right, 6.4 miles to go, and it is 11.57. All right. We'll make it. If we were two mile an hour hikers, we'd be there at <sighs> three something. So we'll probably get there about five. I'm thinking five. Yeah. yeah. I'd love to think that it could be four something. Yeah. But. Worst case, we'll five. See. That's Culver Lake down there. We just had our little break up on the rocks. And it's time to head on. We got at least four more miles. So let's do this. We're coming down to Culver Gap. So everybody knows what a gap means. We got a big old climb on the other side. And it's after two. So we just missed the restaurant that had the deli. So uh, everybody else made it. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, head up the other side. Yeah, oh well. Lots of cedar trees in here. Very big. nice to have the pine. You can smell it, you know. This could be our lucky day after all. <laughs> there really is trail magic. So there was real trail magic. Got to sit there for a little while. The whole gang was there. I'll uh, leave a link to Wild on the Trail channel. He's uh, He's got a lot more subscribers than me. He, I like his channel. He's a very good storyteller. So we had great trail magic. I had a orange and a sun-kissed orange drink and some Cheetos. It tasted good. So we got a fire tower coming up, but that's at the top of this gap. So it won't be long and I'll be climbing. The name of the guy providing the trail magic was named Moose. So he said he'd been hiking uh, some sections uh, over the years with the Girl Scouts. They would do a hundred mile sections each year. So his uh, feet are giving him problems now. Um, so it looks like he's done Pennsylvania through or up to Maine. But now he does uh, trail magic. We're on top, or getting on top. I can hear thunder. That's not an airplane. <laughs>
about 4.35. With the trail magic, it made us a little later. So the shelter's over this way. So we're gonna go check it out, get set up, hopefully dry out our tent a little. So this is our shelter. Grin Anderson Shelter. So we're staying, me and Pollyanna are staying inside the shelter. And we got Blue Jay in the blue tent and all in a section hiker down in the white tent. So uh, not sure if it's gonna rain, but uh, we got our tent dried out and now we're just gonna take it easy in the shelter. So I just figured I'd do a wrap up for today. Today is Thursday and we hiked 14.9 miles to Grin Anderson Shelter. Uh, what was cool is that there was a small bubble today and we kept running into people. And the one thing that was special was Wild on the Trail. So he has a YouTube channel, which I'll put in the description, um, but it was kind of neat meeting him. And it was funny that he was in his skivvies when the two ladies came down the the road to go get water and he's basically <laughs> half naked. So uh, it was kind of funny because I had asked him if I could take a picture and he was like, uh, how about back at the camp? <laughs> when I have some clothes on. <laughs> I mean, for me, it was like he had swimming trunks on. What do I know? But anyway, it was kind of funny. And then... Uh, most of the people made it to this deli, but Pollyanna and I are a little slower, so we missed it by 10 minutes. And, but, oh yeah, and then we walked down the road thinking this gas station was going to have pops, and it didn't. So then we were all bummed out, but then just down the, the trail, there was trail magic, and that's where everybody was. So we met up with everybody again. Sat there and had some trail magic, a fresh orange. And Pollyanna, you had tangerine and a peach. Yes, and yeah. Moose was awesome. Yeah, so Moose was the trail angel. And um, as I mentioned before, he uh, he likes being out on the trail, but his body's kind of given up for the backpacking. So he's doing trail magic for people. So we hiked on and made it to our shelter. And Pollyanna and I are going to stay in the shelter tonight. Blue Jay's out in his tent. We thought it was going to rain, but it's not thundering anymore. So we'll see. Who knows what tomorrow will bring. Looking forward to it.